Hello there and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do a very quick review, a very quick videos about my new laptop, the MSI GF63 Thin 10UC-433. So what this laptop have is the new NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3050. It's a Max Q uh, RTX GPU. Well, as you know, I have some uh, experience in mining, just a small experience, short experience. So I just want to share with you guys for those who wanted to know the mining performance of this GPU, the RTX 3050. Uh, well, you should be able to know. Uh, the approximate performance of the laptop GPU uh, from my video so as you can see here I have been running this mining uh, from nice hash for about 10 minutes so basically this RTX 3050 is a 4 gig GDDR6 uh, GPU so without uh, wasting much time let's just took a look on the GPU what you can see here is the profitability of this GPU sorry my camera is not that good at auto focusing let me okay currently this RTX 3050 is doing around a dollar and 35 cents with some tweaks it can go up to a dollar and 40 45 depends on your uh, setting but because I have the old MSI afterburner the 430 I couldn't get much control on the laptop I can only increase the core clock and the memory clock so currently it's mining raven the uh, kapow the performance is around 9 point it's already went down I believe it's due to the uh, thermal throttling because right now I'm hitting around 69 70 -ish degrees on the temperature of the GPU so initially the speed is quite good uh, let me check back initial speed is around 10 mega hash I'm seeing 10.4 before this so after 10-15 minutes the speed already went down to 9.4 to 9.6 currently so uh, it's uh, 9.65 Six eight mega hash on Raven, so this gives us a total around a total profitability profitability sorry around almost three thousand satoshis per day. So temperature wise, it's not. I don't think the temperature is good, but well, as you can see, this is a laptop. So basically, the temperature should shoot up anytime when we start the mining so what I know is that the RTX 3050 Ti are capable of hitting around 11 mega hash uh, on Raven uh, algorithm so this GPU on the other hand is only capable around 10 I believe let's see the benchmark I'm hitting around 9.97 is around 10 uh, so it's around 10 almost 3000 satoshi but that's not the, the info is that not that important because we know the price for this uh, algorithm will vary will change over time depends on the market value and sentiments and the asking price from buyer and seller so basically this is the performance that you will kind of expect when you buy a laptop with 
RTX 3050 and you want to do some or want to test some mining so this should be your benchmark not benchmark this should be your expectation on the laptop performance particularly the, the GPU on this NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3050 so basically my I have opened up the backplate of this uh, laptop before and the cooling I believe is okay there are one giant heat pipes if I'm if I'm not mistaken that is cooling off the GPU chipset so um, what do you think maybe another laptop another owners outside there uh, do have the similar do have a similar GPU configuration maybe you are getting higher uh, hash rate compared to me maybe you can share in the comments below what do you think about this laptop with this performance overall so basically this laptop costs le less than a thousand dollars if I'm not mistaken after some calculation it's around 900 plus ish dollars but I'm not quite sure about the market price of GPUs either on the full size GPU or the laptop counterparts but this is the performance we are getting around 10 9. 9.6 to 10 mega hash on Raven well I guess we can conclude that this GPU able to mine to do some cryptocurrency mining particularly on Raven on Kaupau uh, the maximum temperature uh, you will expect going to 70 degrees my ambient room temperature is around 23 degrees Celsius so it's kind of bit hot over here but it's okay I'm just testing it I'm not going to let my new laptop do all the hard work here yeah and yes well thank you for viewing my videos Thank you for coming to my channel if you don't mind please click subscribe and follow me and do the comment below and I will try to uh, reply to every comments that's uh, that's on my videos so thank you once again and we'll see you again bye bye